<laughs> hey guys, I think they're ready for us. Uh oh, well, we're not ready. Um, guys, I think we're on right now. Um, hi everybody, welcome to the Art Mobile. And this is. Hey guys, I'm Haley. I'm Lucas. And I'm Brooke. By now, as you look around, I guess you can tell where we are. This is the Totally Mod Artmobile. And our job in the Artmobile is to tell you a little bit about a style of art called modernism from the 20th century. Wait, what is this Artmobile again? It's a totally fun place where we can explore all different kinds of art. You mean there's more than one kind of art? Yes, and all the names of the different kinds of modern art end in ism. There's realism, Favism, Cubism, Expressionism, Surrealism, Abstract Expressionism. All these isms sound very confusing. What do they mean? Well, each ism represents a different style of art. Huh? Hmm. Well, there's got to be an easier way to explain this. Haley, let's go check backstage. We'll be right back, everyone. Guys, I think I found something. Use me to explore isms. Yep, this should definitely work. Whoa, what is this? Where are we? Well, it looks like we're in a painting. We're definitely in a painting. An Abraham Ratner painting, to be exact. What's a Ratner? You mean, who is Ratner? Abraham Ratner was a famous painter who was also a writer and philosopher. He explored many different things like stained glass, tapestries, printmaking, and sculpture. He also explored many different styles like futurism, expressionism, cubism, and surrealism. Ism, 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 ism. Which ism was he most famous for? Figurative Expressionism! <laughs> <laughs> and this painting is called Woman with White Gloves. Looks kind of weird if you ask me. I mean, look at the room the woman's in. And look at her face! It's not meant to look like a photograph. It's an expression. Expressionism? Right. Ratner, the artist was using colors in certain lines to express a feeling or a mood through the painting. Seems kind of strange to me. Let's take a look at another one. Whoa. What is this? Looks like my little brother painted it. Ah, abstract expressionism. Yes, this is Alan Lipa's painting, Lyric Tensions. How can this seriously be art? Well, it's not just art, it's a different style of art. You see, Alan Lipa was the son of Esther Gentle and Abraham Ratner's stepson. Wait, who's Esther? Abraham Ratner's wife, but we'll go over that in a minute. So, what's with the splashes of color everywhere? Well, as an abstract expressionist, he was probably trying to convey a feeling or emotion through the painting. In fact, Alan loved jazz music, so most likely he painted this while he was listening to a specific jazz song or artist. You can almost see through the different colors and shapes the rhythm of the music. Hmm. Besides being a painter, Leap was also a teacher, author, and philanthropist. What's a philanthro whatever? Philanthropist. It's just a big word that means that he donated all of his artwork to create the Lerma. What's a Lerma? The Lipa Ratner Museum of Art. At St. Petersburg College. On the Tarpon Springs campus, where all this art is displayed. Oh cool, I wanna go there. Well, let's go there right now. Oh, sculpture. I've seen these before. What type of ism is it? Well, 
the artist didn't really have any specific art style. Yes, Esther Gentle was a sculptor, a printmaker, and a painter. She even owned her own print studio in New York City. Oh, she's Alan's mom, and she was married to Abraham Ratner. Very good. Ah, Don Quixote. This is called a found object sculpture because she used objects she found to make the sculpture. Well, that doesn't sound like an ism. It's all part of modernism, which means finding new ways to express yourself. So, this is the Lerma, right? Yes, the Lipa Ratner Museum of Art, which has all sorts of different artwork from Alan Lipa, Esther Gentle, and Abraham Ratner. Sounds like there's a lot of isms there. Oh, yeah. Uh, guys, I think we're running out of time here. Let's head back to the art mobile. These kids have a lot more to see. You ready for your pop quiz, Lucas? Fire away. Tell us about the different isms. Each ism represents a different style of art. Today we saw um, figurative expressionism, abstract expressionism, and um, Modernism. Wow, so you were paying attention. What did you think I was doing? So, what's next? Well, these guys have to move on to the next activity in the art mobile. Remember guys, your journey into modern art doesn't have to end when you leave the art mobile today. That's right, you can always go to the Lipa Ratner Museum of Art at St. Petersburg College. On the Tarpon Springs campus. Your teacher will tell you all about it. Lucas, give us the paintbrush back. 